back to a play from earlier as we show you our State Farm assist of the game. And he sliced the D wide open with this feed. They had no chance to prevent that basket. Well, that's what a great pass will do, right? You love the unselfish play. The fourth quarter has arrived. So good to have you with us. Celtics leading by eight. Williams is out there with Fox. Then it's David West. And it's Day in at the two. That's who's in the game for the Celtics. Dishes it to Fox. For the three. And again, Boston with the triple. And so many teams now look to establish the perimeter to set up everything else. No doubt it's a growing trend, Greg, and he is highly accurate tonight. Pass to Ogalskis. The pass to Sura. Lock at six. 16 feet away, and the Cavaliers get another bucket right there. I mean, even he was surprised to be that open. Fourth quarter of basketball. We're about a minute into it. Outside, Fox. Nice ball movement by Boston. The putback. He hangs in there and cashes in on the second chance points. And the Celtics lead by 11. That is really good work there on the offensive glass. Here's Sir. Guarded by Fox. Fades. And Boston with the rebound. Day's got four rebounds now tonight. 13. That's his second personal foul. First team foul. Celtics leading by 11. We've gone about a minute and a half into the fourth quarter. Left side, Williams. Kicks today. Pass to West. Now, Fox. Passes it today. Beyond the arc. Can't hit that one. And Cleveland will come the other way. And it is Number flushed 13. down with a nice jam. Assistant. Really crisp, intelligent passing to make that basket possible. Boston's gone one and three from outside the arc since we've reached the fourth quarter. Wesley with the ball. Pass today. Shoots the three. Up and in. That's his tenth break in the contest. He has only taken 13 shots. Yeah, in the first half, he was unstoppable from deep. Now, two more since the break. The pass to Mills. Fires the three. And another three for Cleveland. Their three-point percentage has taken a big leap here in this second half. A little over two and a half minutes have passed here in the fourth quarter. Pass today. Six to shoot. Pulls it up. That one off the back iron and out. Listen, we know the mid-range game is in this guy's arsenal, but you wonder should he have moved it just one pass more. He's really taking care of the ball. That's just his first turnover of the night. Here's West. And we're about three minutes into the fourth quarter. Pass today. Fires for three. The rebound by Ogauskas. The Cavaliers trail by nine. And foul Boston on the shot. Foul. He'll shoot two at the free throw line. Foul. First wow. Foul. wow, he got whacked on that one. Shouldn't be the much made the there. Cavaliers. Number 13. That one is off. Two shots. He's good on the second. And here is Wesley. The rebound by Ilgauskas. Ilgauskas has got rebound number eight now on the night. And you can feel the excitement in the building. Both of these teams 
pouring it on. There's been a bit of a flurry here late, and this game may come down to which side gets a stop or two. And a little over three and a half minutes in the books so far here in the fourth. Here's Williams, and good as it just snugs right down through the net. And you can just see he's a different player since coming back from halftime. Here is Sir, covered by Wesley. Here's Mills, banked in off the glass. Mills has got five points now this quarter. And guys, all about hard work from this point on. They worked hard to create that high quality shot and then able to knock it down. Raja, covered by Ogauskas. The three. Day, no good. The Cavaliers trail by six. Here he goes. And the shot goes in. And when you thought this fourth quarter was simply a formality, all of a sudden the offense picks up. And now we have a game. Ball's not loose. Now here's Mills. He's guarded close. Good work defensively by Fox. Celtics leading by four. It's Wesley on the wing. Day the pass to Wesley. This ball movement by Boston. And again for three. Buries his tenth triple of the game. Unbelievable. The Cavaliers trail by seven. Here's Sura. He takes it in. Power down with both hands. Yeah, he just punched the ticket on that one. That'll get the job done. Powerful two and jam. Here's Wesson. Now a timeout called by Boston. The short rest, very important. And one of the benefits of this part of the game is getting on the same page with your team while having the chance to hydrate with Gatorade. Replenish your energy for the late game push. And the Celtics making a change here. Walker's checked in. Let's go now to the sideline and catch up with David Aldridge. Hi, Kevin. Well, the head coach for the Celtics talked to his team during the break. He said, I love how we're shooting the basketball. You guys have been locked in from three. Just keep taking makeable shots. If you don't have it, pass it to the guy who does. Kevin? All right, thank you, David. For Cleveland, they've gone seven of nine from the field down the stretch here in the fourth quarter. Terrific shooting. Driving the lane. Count that one. They are attacking the rim and getting great results. Celtics leading by five. Now West. And block. That one goes careening off the glass. I'll tell you, even though he's not playing his best basketball, the team has played well and picked it up. I love it. Mill. And the layup is good. Now it's just a three-point Boston lead. I, I love the ball movement there. He put that on a silver platter. Just served him up. Here's West to the feet. Here's Roger. The kick out to Walker. Puts up a three. Here's Fox, and contact on the shot, so he'll be shooting free throws here. And Fox, strong, very confident player, an excellent defender, and a solid shooter. Impeccable from the line since halftime. At the line for two shots. Fox hits them both. The Cavaliers trail by five. Here's Brandon. Pass to Mills. Over to the left wing. Six on the shot clock. Fires it up. Walker with the rebound. Walker's got six rebounds in the game. Fox passes to Walker. That shot missing. 
And for the Cavaliers, their shooting has been great, up over 50%. In fact, 52%. Ilgowski's trying to get open, and that one drops for him. The assist. 19 points in the game. Man, have they been effective at getting the ball inside. Now, here's Walker. Williams up on top. In change shot. And that's out of bounds. Boston will retain possession. And Boston has possession. At one point, they led by 16. There's the pass to Brandon. Can't tie it up as that one misses. And Walker's got the ball here for the Boston Celtics. Three-point lead. Williams dishes to Walker. David Wesley on the wing. Walker at the elbow. He kicks it to Fox. Lock at six. Pass to West. Here's Walker. Williams for three. And it's Williams again missing. Going inside, and that one's good. Brandon. Brandon. Now just a one-point Celtic lead. Nicely done. They continue to attack inside, and that's ten points in a row in the paint. Passes it to Walker. Again, the miss by the Celtics. Now you can't look at the result of that shot. They'll take that whenever they get it. And they should, because it's when you start turning down that kind of look that your three offense points. can start to bog down a bit. Challenging this D with the three ball. That's his second from distance this half. And he also hit one in the first half, too. Here's Raja. Shot to stop the run. And a rebound goes to the Cavaliers. And boy, have they been hitting the backboard in this game. What? Kind of surprising. It's such a tight game. Here's Brandon, and it's blocked. Fox with it. Pass to Williams. Back to Fox. Wesley the pass to Walker. Got a hand on it, and he's able to get it back. The Cavaliers pull it in. Ilgowskis has got nine rebounds in the game, getting it done. Here's Brandon, guarded by Walker. Ilgowskis, good again. He's on tonight, nine for 13 shooting. What a great shooting performance. His percentage is outstanding. They need a good offensive possession. Yeah, they've gone a long time without a bucket. Two left to the fourth. This ball movement by Boston. Outside, Fox. Williams finds Fox. Here's Walker. Beat the shot clock, but it's off the mark. After the strong first half, this guy has not been the same. And largely a no-show right here. We've got 128 left to play in the final quarter. Here's Ogoskis. And the layup for him. And now a six-point Cavalier lead. Boston. Well, this is what you're trying to do. Put the game away. And he hasn't forced much tonight. I love the efficiency he's giving to that. And now a moment to present the New Balance player of the game. And his focus, guys, has been laser sharp. And his touch from the field, flawless. The teammates have worked hard to get him the ball in some good positions. And boy, has he rewarded them with a spectacular shooting performance. Great call to keep running all those sets for him. One twenty-two left in the fourth quarter. Walker taking his time here. Count it good. We've got 113 left in the fourth quarter. 
Here's Brandon. To the middle. And Ogauskas kicks to Mills. He's guarded by Williams. Shot clock at five. Good. Nice Good job down low. And the Cavaliers lead by six. Celtic shooting an appalling 26% in the fourth quarter. Here's Walker. It's rebounded by Tyrone Hill. He's guarded by Williams. The pass to Brandon. They get the rebound. Ogaskis, the pass to Hill. Kicks it to Mills. Pass to Brandon. Shot clock at six. To the wing on the left. Second shot opportunity. And it's Fox with the rebound. Now a timeout called by Boston. They're down by six. Twelve seconds left in the fourth quarter of this one. Here's Fox. A three off the inbound. It drops. What a beautiful shot to bring him to within three. And they have been relentless from deep. And you ball. see the defense trying to react, yeah. but to no avail. Well, that's the whole point, isn't it? If you space the floor well enough, it's almost impossible for the defense to account for everyone. And he commits the intentional foul. He had to foul and on that occasion to stop the clock. That's the enemy in this situation. Shooting for Cleveland, Terrell Brandon, taking two shots. He hits the first one, and that gives them a four-point cushion. And so both free throws are good, and it's a five-point game. And you can wrap this one up. Great job to stay cool at the line and finish it off. Here's Fox. Can't connect from long distance. And so it's Cleveland winning this one. A narrow win under difficult circumstances, Greg, as the visiting team. Yeah, it really was, but that didn't seem to bother them. I mean, road team, home team, all I know is they were the better team. Well said. Thank you for joining us. That'll do it for now. For Greg Anthony, Doris Burke, and David Aldridge, and the rest of our terrific crew, this is Kevin Harlan saying thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.